Hello, people, and we are back. So, we had a minor mess up here. Um, yeah, apparently, at the final seconds of the last short episode, uh, I have somehow managed to, um, clone a minion. Yeah, you see, these are the four minions who are loyal to me, and this minion... Actually, no, this is the minion that is disloyal. I don't know how to destroy him. Uh, so I'm not going to bother. <laughs> but they did bring us some nice loot. Uh, lots of redstone. Ah! Perfect. This was just what I was hoping they would find me. Lots and lots of lava, which is, this is exactly what I wanted. Oh, oh how lucky am I? I just found some iron. The only thing that would be nicer than iron is diamond. Okay, so I'm just going to be mining up at this angle here. We're going to be working our way towards the lava. Now, let us hope and pray that the lava is not above us in a massive pool. Because that would just suck such shit. I heard him say, for you, Master, but I don't remember seeing anything. Hmm. It's a very tricky thing, trying to manipulate lava. And that, that is why you never mind blocks directly overhead, children. Oh, gold. I could use gold. Yeah, I hate it when there's just these huge gravel pockets underground. It just makes mining so difficult when you aren't doing it yourself, you know. We're also having some... Oh! Oh, and lapis, too! Must be my lucky day. Nah, it's, it's too late for luck. I already have a dragon dangerously close to burning my house down, and a uh, whole bunch of crashes happening. So no, I, I would not say today is our lucky day. Also, this is this is Cinnabar ore, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, Cinnabar from Thomcraft. Uh, hopefully we should be getting kind of close. Here, the lava. Ooh, boys. Now you see, this is why you don't stand on top of things that you're mining. Okay. Yep. Okay. Uh. Okay. Okay. Let's let us begin maneuvering here. Okay, we have isolated the lava. <gasps> no, no. Okay. See? See? We're safe. Now. 
Water bucket, fucker! <laughs> Yeah, we'll be in the nether in no time at this rate. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and neutralize all that. Oh! Well... I have a decent source of fuel down here. Let's see, this is the problem with mining right next to lava. You can never tell if the ore is going to be right over a pool of it. See? Okay, okay. I think it's only a block deep around here, so we should be able to Stand right here in mine. See? This is what I'm talking about when it comes to awareness. I have none. <laughs> so yeah, we're not going to have any obsidian shortage, it seems. <laughs> Uh, I actually may keep a few of these lava blocks around, just because, you know, it may be good to have a source of light down here, since I don't have any torches. here. Let's see. I bet there's lava behind this. Yep. Man, that stream goes back there, too. Yeah, yeah, it won't be too long now. And we'll be in the nether. I mean, we already got just about enough. Okay, and there's more lava, of course. Of course there's more lava. When is there not more lava? I bet this whole area underneath my feet is lava, too. I, I bet you that is what is the case. I bet if I mine this, there's lava under it. Wow, there isn't. Okay. <laughs> okay. Seems like finding the edge of this here pretty quick. It would be so much easier with an enchanting, an enchantment, but uh, sadly I don't have uh, enough resources to break into Thomcraft, yeah. Thomcraft or um, equivalent exchange, so I wouldn't be able to uh, make any way to enchant stuff quickly. 
mean, this is a great node full of ores, though. I mean, these are some great ores. And all this coal and redstone up here. Yeah, this is this is some straight up gold shit right here. I mean, it's probably good I live so close to a large amount of lava, and these are viz crystals, and I don't feel like getting into Thaumcraft just yet, but, you know, it's good to have them around, too. Okay. Okay, did you see that? That could have been trouble. Got some gold. Ooh, I think this may be silver. Let's see. Yep, this is silver from Ice and Fire. Should be able to give me some armor. I don't know what the perks of silver armor are. That it might just be stronger than gold, but weaker than iron. Okay. Well, that uh, that iron is. Lucky. <laughs> uh, yeah, I got ten blocks. Ten blocks of obsidian. Uh, you know, I should probably mine some more. Man, it sure is windy outside. But, uh, hopefully everything should be okay. <sighs> yeah, this recording session has been very tough. Yeah, I'll get a decent amount. That way I won't have to come back down here if I need more. I'd get some buckets of lava too, but uh, I didn't bring enough buckets, sadly. on the other side of this. some neutral viz crystals over here. There's more stuff further down. You know, mining down here is a great way to get lots of good resources. And you're also more likely to come across diamonds and stuff at this depth. But, uh, you know, you really gotta ask the question. Uh, is it worth the risk? And I think that it is. Right. Well, seems like that's the end of the trail of lava. Apparently there's some Terra Viz crystals clinging. 
Now I can't see them from this angle, but I know they're there. Let me, let me grab some more iron. I'll put that in the furnace upstairs. And, uh, you know, I'll say that's good for now. You know something? I do not remember how I got in here. <laughs> I think I, I think I fell I'm up here. Maybe. Maybe I'm just dumb. I, I don't know. Maybe I did. Just... Uh. No. No, I did not. So, instead, I'm just going to teleport home. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we got some we got some good resources. Lots of gravel. That would be useful. Uh, let me grab my coal. I'll split it in half, and I'll... Uh, Divided up here. Okay, so yeah, these will be smelting ore for me. I think I should go slaughter some animals out back so that I can. Um, Yeah, he's the black rabbit. So yeah, these rabbits will be, will be just fine for the foreseeable future. Okay, yeah, they're breeding. That should be a good enough population of pigs. That gave me 11 pork chops. Yeah, that's going to be good. I mean, this is this is the good thing about Minecraft. We know that the pigs are already derpy and inbred, so we don't have to really worry about inbre the effects of inbreeding. Yeah, now we have plenty of gold, which I can use for something, I'm sure. There's charged certus quartz, which I know is useful for a bunch of different recipes in Minecraft. What the? I don't see anything. Maybe a cockatrice. I know there's some out there. Somewhere. Oh yeah, some delicious good old cooked pork chops. Okay. Well, uh, I think I should order the minions to uh, put their materials. Okay. Okay. 
you got to be one block away from where you can access it. Okay, and now I go down here and tell them to get mining. Okay, there's one who hit lava, two who hit lava, three who hit lava, four who hit lava. Oh, come on, there's lava in all four cardinal directions. Now this is getting stupid. <laughs> okay, <laughs> fine, fine, okay. I will order them to strip mine here. What's this? What's this? There. We'll start clearing out chunks underground for me. And then they'll take their newly found goods and put it in the chest upstairs. Well, this is going to be just about the end of the episode, so I'm going to cut it here, and I'll be back as soon as possible. So, till next time, fuck you.